What's up, pole dancers? This is Ina, and today we are learning pole dance, dragon tail move. So let me first explain the lesson structure. Um, we are gonna start from me demonstrating the trick, and then after that, uh, I will tell you pre-requirements that you need to be able to do before trying this move and uh, then we will move to three ways to enter the trick and after that we will learn few transitions uh, from dragon tail pole dance move and uh, at the end I will give you some tips this move is more about flexibility rather than strength even though you need uh, some decent amount of strength to be able to hold your body uh, upside down but, but this uh, move is actually, it looks good if you are pretty flexible First, you need to have enough flexibility in your back. You need to have uh, flexible legs, in, like perfect if you can do splits. And the uh, third requirement is that you need to be able to do inverted chopper. I will demonstrate. dynamic stretching. Arm swings to start off. I like doing these leg swings before my workout to open my hips and hamstrings and also to warm up my back as I arch it with each swing. Arching and rounding your back to get more blood to your back muscles. making back circles and head circles to, for preparing your neck as well. Side to side back swings exaggerate the motion including your shoulders, move them up and down accordingly. Round and arch your back like I am doing it, again to bring more blood to your back. This chest circle exercise is used in exotic pole, so it's a good drill to practice in your warm-up routine. Hamstring stretch, we need it as dragon tail pull and smooth requires spreading legs in front of split. I like to move my butt from side to side to warm up muscles that surround this hamstring as well. I also do the same motion when I warm up my splits on the floor. Try it, you will like it. Bending and straighten the knee for better hamstring stretch. Step 1. Get into outside leg hand. Step 2. Wrap the pole with inside arm fingertips down. Push the pole away with your straight arm so that your torso is away from the pole. Support your back with outside arm 
and put it in thumbs up grip. Step 3. Slide down inside the hand down the ball. Bend your free leg, bring it in and catch the ball with your hip. Step 4. While squeezing the ball with inside hip, release your outside knee hold and bend it. Straighten your inside leg as well. For better look, you can bend your back and reach your toes for your head. Now we will look for a few variations how to enter the uh, dragon tail pull and smoke. And the first one is from outside leg hand as we already uh, saw it in uh, step by steps breakdown. So just one more time to remind. Second way to enter the pole dance dragon tail move is from inside leg hand. Notice that in this variation we bend the outside leg first and then straighten the inside leg. Entrance variation number 3 from open V or chopper. So we do the chopper first and then notice after we fixed in this position we drive outside leg back and bend it I have to admit that this variation is harder because you need to drive straight leg back and while you're doing it you tend to lose the balance Entrance variation number 4 is from Shooting Star. I actually like this variation most because you already put one of your hands on the ball and then just wrap your back with free hand and you're ready to go. Another my favorite variation is to enter from reverse V and this is nice also because you already wrap your back with outside hand and just when you're in inverted you just put inside hand on the ball and you're also ready to go. Tip number one, keep your inside hip in contact with ball and squeeze it, otherwise you will end up like me. Again, keep tight, squeeze it and keep in contact with the ball. Let's look from the other angle. Here I'm struggling to spread my legs in the split because again I don't have contact with the ball. Tip number two, make sure that you are high enough, otherwise you end up like me bending your inside arm, <laughs> trying to look nice, but again from another angle, I'm too low. I can't do this move normally. After you practice pole dance dragon tail move from different entrance variations, and when you feel comfortable in it, you can try uh, advanced version of pole dance dragon tail split. Try to catch balance here. different 
channel so that you see how I drive my outside leg back keeping my inside leg in contact with ball to dismount from dragon ball split just get into inside leg hang like this video comment below tell me what you want to see in the next tutorials like it share it please subscribe for more videos they are coming